Everything has become too costly. I request the government to reduce prices because Ramadan is coming. They should think of the Muslims who would be fasting. There are poor laborers here who push wheelbarrows from morning until evening and only earn 250 rupees at the end of the day. What are they going to eat during Ramadan and what are they going to save for their families? Even medicines have become more expensive. I request the rulers to stop filling their own pockets and pay some heed to the poor public. Inflation has risen so much that the dates that were selling for 200 rupees per kilogram last year are now at 500 rupees. At the same time, petrol, bus fare, rent and other expenses have also tremendously increased. What can we do? Where should we go? Who should we complain? There is no one who will listen to our woos. Don't even ask about inflation. Everything is beyond reach of the poor. They cannot even look at all these things on sale. In fact, even people from the middle class are compelled to think, what should we buy? What should we forego? This huge crowd that you are seeing here are only asking about prices and then going away. Not many people are purchasing here. Prices have really gone very high this year. What can a poor person do? We cannot buy anything. I am a working woman myself. I work for other households. What can people like me do? The real cause of inflation is the chaos in the country. There is no law. As long as the chaos remains and without stability in the country, prices will not come down. I appeal to the rulers to put an end to their differences, their quarrels, the protests and rallies. <laughs> Thank you.